everybody I know it's been forever since I recorded the last video um, uh, several months <laughs> and um, I wanted to come in and say what's up and kind of update you not on everything that's happened but on the kind of big things and talk to you a little bit about a different platform through which I've been providing weekly updates and have lots of plans for so um, let me just get started. For those of you that don't know, my name is Samus. I'm a producer, I'm a rapper, and a PhD student. And I guess a year or, or a long time ago, maybe even two years ago, I decided to start making kind of weekly vlogs to talk a little bit about some of the things that I was working on and provide updates. And um, I was doing pretty good with them. And then the past few, it was like, you know, months in between um, for just a variety of reasons. But yeah, so let me let me get started with the update. So, the I guess first biggest update is that I'm moving from Ithaca, New York, after being here since 2011 <laughs> for grad school. I'm not finished yet, but I am writing, which is good. Um, finished in terms of my PhD. For those who were, who were wondering what I'm talking about, um, but me, Bay, and I are going to live in Philadelphia. We already have an apartment, and it's awesome. And uh, apartment hunting was a really interesting experience because, you know, smashing two people's lives together is, is always challenging. But in terms of the things that we both needed out of an apartment, it, it was a struggle. But we found the, the actual perfect place, so it's great. Um, and for those of you who are like, why Philly? Because um, I don't have family in Philly or really, a, you know, kind of deep, intimate, intimate connection with it. And neither does um, my boo. But basically, um, we were thinking about, like, next steps because he is done teaching this year. And um, he's a writer. And so he can kind of be anywhere. And I, you know, now that I'm past my, my A exams and my department and I'm kind of a... I'm a full-time musician. Um, I can kind of be anywhere too. So we were like, where can we be that's strategic and that's good and going to be good for both of our careers? Um, and I hate New York City for anybody that knows. It's been in other videos and stuff like that. Um, but I still, I recognize how important being on the East Coast is because I've built so many connections and relationships with people here. Like touring wise, the East Coast is the best place to be because there's like, so many little cities and small like liberal arts colleges and um, you know and New York City is here as much as I despise it it is an important place to be close to so um, you know it was like well what about the silly the city that's close to New York City that's not New York City and that a lot of great artists I know live in which is Philly so we checked it out and really just fucked with it. Um, it's not nearly as expensive as New York City, which is awesome. Um, and like I said, so many of the artists that I love and appreciate um, are in Philly or are in New York City, which is close enough. My manager is in Jersey City. So yeah, it's just, I feel very good about this decision. Um, and so yeah, that's kind of the big exciting update. And what that has means is that this summer, we're, we're moving on July 1st, so this summer basically what I wanted to do was just work on new music. And I already have, if you follow me on Twitter at Samus Music, S-A-M-M-U-S Music, you will see that I have just been working on new music recently, which has been so nice. Like, ugh, I just want to show y'all stuff, but I, I can't right now, but I'm... Hoping to release something in the in 2018, so I'm making moves towards completing that. And, and a full-length album is what I'm gearing towards, and potentially a collaborative project that I can't really talk about the person that I'm doing it with. But if you fuck with me, you'll fuck with this person pretty much. I know that. Um, so yeah, that's uh, <laughs> that's the move for the rest of the summer. So uh, my boo is going to Rome for like a teaching program. I'm just gonna be here in Ithaca working on music, have like one or two shows. Other than that, making my fucking music, which I have not had time to be able to do in so long. Like literally, I'm not taking on anything else. My All of my emails have been like, no, I can't do this. No, I can't do this. No, I can't do this. I don't wanna do this. Um, so yeah, feel very, very good about 
about this next next step in life um, in terms of other updates yeah so I'm back from New York City um, obviously um, New York City was cool I was there for the semester um, teaching at NYU and that was a good experience I didn't realize how much time um, a once a week class was gonna take uh, just in terms of like prep and you know all of the things that go into teaching so you know it was great in terms of the amount of time that I actually had to be there and be in New York City, you know, for touring and other stuff. But it, it was pretty time consuming and, and it took a lot of energy from me. Uh, but the experience is over. So <laughs> that's all that matters. But being in New York City was fun. It was cool. I enjoyed my experience and I performed a lot. I went on a small tour and, um, yeah, I'm trying to remember when the last time I updated. Did I, had I already gone on tour in the last update? I don't even know. But <laughs> um, in that time, I've opened for No Name. I, like... Um, have just been able to perform at lots of colleges. Like, I'm really feeling like I'm making momentum. I was featured in a Red Bull special um, about video games and culture. So, yeah, big things. I know I'm leaving a lot of, there's a lot of stuff that I'm leaving out, but whatever. And to kind of follow that thread, the reason why I'm not necessarily as concerned with, with updating you all here is that I've been putting a lot of energy and time into my Patreon account. Um, so for those of you that don't know, Patreon is like a subscriber-based um, kind of funding platform. And um, basically you can, you know, give as much as or as little as one dollar a month um, to support artists of your choice. So there are people that are like comic book artists, there's uh, people like me who have a podcast, there's musicians and other folks who do things either on a monthly basis or like a per episode basis. Um, and so uh, for the past, I don't think it's been a year, maybe the past few months, I've been working on this podcast with, with my boo um, called the Zero Suits Podcast Situation. And basically, for anyone that knows, Metroid Zero Suits refers to not wearing the armor Um and so being very open. So in the podcast, we talk a lot about everything. Um, and when we're pissed at each other, you can hear that. <laughs> There's no sort of holding back. Uh, but anyways, this has been a great way to communicate with people about kind of what's going on with me on a weekly basis. Because I have a newsletter. I send it out like once every two months, once a month if I'm really on top of things. Um, you know, and I send out the updates for a dollar a month and I'll just kind of tell people everything that's going on. But what I want to start doing is um, having more sort of interaction with folks through video. So um, I want to use the Patreon to like um, maybe set up like a live, you know, like a YouTube live situation or like a Google Hangout where people can come and like chop it up with me or I can chop it up with them about things that are going on in their lives. Um, and like, I don't know. It would just be like a cool, a cool little thing that we could do. And I want to use the YouTube more for stuff like that than to just do these kind of monthly or like once every four months updates. Um, so that's where I'm at. Um, so if you want to contribute to the Patreon or see what I already have going on, it's uh, Patreon, P-A-T-R-E-O-N dot com slash Samus uh, Music, I think. Um, I should probably know that since I'm promoting it, but whatever. I'll put a link below if I if I fuck that up. Um, so yeah, I, I really wanted to make this video mostly to speak about that and like how, especially moving into this new part of my life where I'm going to be a like full time musician for real, for real. Like I'm not taking on any teaching positions or anything. Um, Patreon has been been a really important source of support for me, and I would love to make it grow and. Um, yeah, I this summer have the time to really commit to the podcast to make it what I want it to be, which is me being open with you all about, you know, not just my relationship and stuff like that, but also how a song comes to be. Um, so in the podcast, basically what happens is um, I will, I'm moving in chronological order, but I pick a song from my catalog, um, Lon Ray, my boo, and I, we talk about like what the song meant, how it kind of came to be. And then we have a conversation about the sort of broader implication of it. Um, but people have said they want me to spend more time really, really talking about how a song comes to be. So I'm thinking that I might do something like a beat breakdown at the end and like 
provide the pieces, the actual pieces of the track to show you like, oh, these are the layers that go into the thing, um, especially for sort of aspiring musicians. I know that can be helpful. So, gosh, that was a lot. Um, so yeah, that's where I'm at right now. Um, thanks so much to everybody who's supported thus far. I might, you know, make another video like this. I might not. Um, but for now, I'm going to be, I think, making kind of update videos, but putting them on the Patreon page. And so they, they'll be unlisted and you can see them if you're a subscriber. Um, just because it makes it easier for me to have one place where I'm doing my updates. Um, so that's that. Leave, leave comments, leave love, leave questions or whatever below. Um, I'm happy to be back-ish <laughs> and have more time. Okay. I love you. Bye.